right guys target trip and haven't been here in like a month or so so this one sometimes has some cool stuff sometimes they are just completely empty with stuff so last time these were had end caps here so not anymore but let's see if we're lucky enough to find anything new oh my god they still have iron man here zombie iron man but they have extremis iron man which i'm gonna just hold off and wait see if we can get that at a lower price look at that four crimson bats four that's so crazy i don't need any crimson bats as cool as they look in the red i don't i don't mind um holding off frankenstein calabac is right there Impulse. Hmm. and what do we got in transformers i, I don't know is most of it the same? I can't, I don't know. Uh, Batwing there. All right. None of the newer stuff. I mean, that's technically new, but it's still cool to see it. Hudson here, Predators. It's always a lot of Predators here. Grim Swords here. Wow. Okay. What is this? Game of Thrones? That's interesting. Um, so nothing new here, but there is Lady J, but look up here, they got Shurian, they have Howard, and a Ironheart, $14.99, 10 bucks, 10 bucks, that's awesome, that's really awesome, so some cool stuff right there. And there's some more there too. Um, yeah, I don't know. Let's see. That's cool. And then here, I guess it's still the same. Got a lot of the soldiers here. Oh, wow. Look at that. $8.99 for the retro card. And that's actually a good card. That looks pristine on Solo. $9.69. I think this is at Ollie's, or some Ollie's, not all Ollie's. Guess that's it. Look what made it to Target. Holy crap. Okay. We got Corsair. Why is it over here? <laughs> we got a ton of Monet. So dedicated character cases. So Corsair and Monet. A lot of Corsair Amone. Holy crap. That's quite a bit. Quite a bit going on right now. Holy moly. Oh, geez, that's all Corsair. Crimson Bats, three of them. I guess that's it. Then, here's the Marvel section. Oh, look at that. There's Cap. So they got Cap in. Nothing else, huh? That is cool. What is over here? Anything? Nope, not that I see. Look at this, finding this here. Why would this be here? This has been clearance a while ago. I'm going to scan it just in case. Look at that. Andra? Oh my god, there's still a lot of those sitting around here. X, he's here. And a Bret Hart. Look at that. Anything? There's another Bret Hart. Cool. All right. Well, they restocked on Cyborg Spider Woman, which belongs way up there. And that's all I see. Man, that sucks. I don't know if we're gonna see any of the newer stuff at this location for a while, because sometimes they're really late on it. But I have to check no matter what. What in the heck, man? It's like they're always restocking on the weirdest stuff. And look at that, there's, whoa. These are 30. Holy crap, Calabac is 30 bucks. Necron, 30 bucks. And so is Fulcum Abominus is 30 bucks. Didn't know that was on sale. That's pretty cool to see. Um, okay. 
bunker. There's one left. Hitman, wow, restock on Hitman. Um, my God, you're gonna be here forever, so are you. And that's it, no new indie. Wow, okay, so they restocked on all the cards of this one character. <laughs> and what the heck, there was more of that too. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna see anything else. It's never gonna happen for me. <laughs> They restocked on spot and spider-man 2099 and there's a spider punk here too wow okay so definite restocks going on for across the spider-verse still cool to see definitely definitely cool still cool to see all right guys we're gonna start digging again they still have these sitting here this is still here but of course the bike is missing so uh but Let's just see what else could be here. Cause yep, new Marvel, 10 bucks. Okay, Bishop, 11. This little mini RC. Sabretooth, 13. Frost is there. And then of course we have, this is the same stack that we saw last time. So nothing really different, Loki's here. Yep. Uh, let's see. More Sabretooth, which we all know that we've seen Sabretooth here several, several times. Uh, yeah. That's really it. Thirteen bucks. That's awesome. This is new, Omega Mon, eight bucks. Huh. Ocean Master still here. Oh, they got a King Shazam in. Blight, wow. That's pretty cool, seeing Blight here. And then Haunt is still here. All these Thresh for five. And I think you're new. They still have this here. No one came and claimed this one. 20 bucks. Uh, who is this? Oh, it's Sabretooth. <laughs> of course. And All right, I don't think we're getting anything today. Everything is still this. Uh, mostly it's the same. There's a She-Hulk down here. Yeah. All right, I think we're good today. What's up guys, how's it going? Thanks for checking out the video. I know it's a lot shorter this time around. Um, I, I did go to a lot of places, but surprisingly, a lot of it was the same. There wasn't really any new stuff that was coming out. Um, nothing more than uh, what you would see at your typical Target. Yes, we are, st we are starting to see some of uh, the Chode Build-A-Figure Wave, which is really nice, very nice to see, but we have the tracksuit mafia that's showing up um, at Targets. I still haven't found it yet. I'm still, you know, hunting them down. Even though I do have it on pre-order, it's kind of like, what's the point? But you know what? It's always fun to see if I can hunt them down and find them. Uh, the other, what else? Ant Man. The Target exclusive Ant Man is also out. Uh, it's being found in several different places. So now we all know. I already have the Chode Builder figure wave, so I am leaving those behind because I don't need it. I don't need doubles of them. It's just nice to see that, you know, newer stuff is coming out. Uh, but I definitely will pick up a Tracksuit Mafia figure. Definitely. I would love to have, you know, some some uh, thugs, I guess, in my collection. Uh, Ant-Man, I can easily hold off on. I don't have that version of Ant-Man, but one day, considering it's an exclusive, we will see how that kind of lasts on the shelves you know it's not one of the a sought after type of figure uh but we will we'll see i so this week nothing really i picked up even with going to total liquidators and half off store yeah they're getting some newer stuff in but it's stuff that i already have so it's nice to see that there are you know more stuff coming in um and if i really wanted to you know like i could pick them up for some friends so it's really cool i did get um some card sleeves right we got some cards the thicker ones and then the regular penny sleeve ones because 
you know, this, the FLIR Ultra Box, these are some thick cards and you really need some penny sleeves to, to <laughs> this. I, I had to get some penny sleeves to do so. Uh, I've just been, you know, having some fun with figures. This, this has been a lot of fun. If you checked out my live stream video uh, this past Monday, open this guy up. Wow, this SH figure arts got very, very nice. So really cool to see that. I may go down a hole and look for some online. It's going to suck, but I will check them out. Uh, but yeah, I am expecting a lot of pre-orders next week, I think, mostly, to come in. There's some SH Figure Arts. There's some uh, stuff from 5K Toys uh, and Loose Collector with the with the Hyde figure. I am definitely excited for that. They're all, like, I got shipping notifications, everything. So I'm expecting to get some packages in. So let's hope we can get them in next week to have something to uh, play around with next week so there you go guys that's it but guys i really appreciate that you stopped by checked out the video i like i said before tuesdays and saturdays are going to be my toy hunt videos everything else in between i'll try to throw in a review or something an unboxing to to kind of mix it up a bit and of course monday nights are the live streams at 9 p.m eastern time so thank you guys as always i appreciate it like comment and subscribe Hope to see you soon, and I hope to see you on the next hunt.